John Count, and I'm here to speak to you about the new Phase 2, which will begin in, on the 4th of May, next Monday. Just to be sure we understand, we're talking about living with the virus, uh, so we must still maintain a safe distance and always be wearing our safety masks. Uh, there will be a fixed price set on safety masks. It will, will not be possible to uh, have a high margin of profit. Uh, around about 50 cents will be the fixed price and there will be no EVA. So this is uh, something that I want to guarantee and make sure that everybody understands. We have uh, been granted some money from the European Union, from the Recovery Fund. This will help us for a rapid economic recovery. But fellow citizens, we must pull up our sleeves. We have hard work in front of us. And this is a team effort. We are all in this together. Let's talk about details now. Um, in phase two from next Monday, uh, we will still be restricted to movement within the regions and uh, only for reasons of uh, emergency, necessity, health or work, same as before. Uh, a new uh, addition is also will be permitted to visit relatives, so grandparents and sons and daughters, grandchildren who have been separated until now will be able to make visits but always in compliance with the safety distance and wearing masks okay uh, we're not talking about big family get-togethers with lots of people these are small visits small gatherings uh, no private parties if you are feeling ill with respiratory problems or a temperature a temperature above 37 degrees Celsius, you must stay at home. It is no longer suggested to stay at home. You must stay at home if you are showing signs of being ill and be in contact with your doctor. Councils will also be able to open public gardens and parks. So uh, children will be able to meet in the park to use the playground, but once again, we're not talking about big groups of people. Keep in mind social distancing and uh, using masks. Moving on to physical activity. You may now move further away from your home if you would like to do physical activity and sport, but you must be keeping a safe distance of at least two meters. Athletes, both professional and non-professional, may um, participate in their training sessions, uh, but group gatherings are not permitted. In this difficult period, it's been very hard for many families who have lost loved ones, in that um, there's not been, it's not been possible to have funerals. So in phase two, uh, funerals will be allowed, a maximum of 15 people, no larger, the gatherings must be small, in an outdoor area, and uh, masks must be worn, and social distancing must be applied. Now, talking about bars and restaurants, uh, up until now, deliveries, home deliveries have been possible. We are also going to add takeaway. It will be possible to order and pick up takeaways, but once again, no group gatherings outside the bars and the restaurants. Um, you must line up orderly and keep social distancing while you're waiting for your takeaway. So that's it for now. Until next time. <laughs>